Hello, welcome to my house and welcome to my channel. I'm Laura Cepeda and I'm very excited to have all of you again. First of all, Merry Christmas. I know that some of you maybe are in your home resting, relaxing with all your family and enjoying this uh, delicious Christmas dinner. Well, today I will show you how you can make this beautiful blanket. Look at the yarn, look at the color. It's very, the yarn is very puffy and you can go from one color to another. This is a degradé or degraded yarn and the stitch seems like it's in relief. And the yarn is so soft and beautiful. I will show you how you can make it. This is a different stitch that I want to share with all of you. This is a stitch that I haven't teached you, but hopefully you enjoyed it. Remember that this is just an idea. And if you want to make this blanket in other way, well, you can make it. I try to make it this way because I feel that it's like the easiest and one pretty way to make a blanket. Well, if you are new in my channel, first I will give you the material list and then I will give you the step by step. Well, for this blanket we are going to need one skein of yarn of 50 grams of Softy Plus. Look, I use this brand. It's of very good quality. The yarn is between light and medium. Look, so we are going to use a crochet hook of number 4 millimeters. If you want to use the same materials that I use in all my videos, here I will leave all the information. Remember that if you want to buy and use the same materials that I use in all my videos, you can visit my online store www.lauracepeda.es Hello, I have a big announcement to make. I want to share with all of you that now you can download and you can buy all my magazines in this new app of My Ideas. Just you have to download the app of My Ideas and there you can find all the different numbers and all the different volumes that I have made with this amazing editorial. You will see that this amazing magazines are so easy to follow. Remember that these magazines are written by me and I share all the diagrams so you can follow and clearly make these amazing breaks with me. So please don't miss it and download all the magazines. Well with one thread and with our hook we are going to start making chains. We are going to make 90 chains. If you need to make more, well, you are going to need more material. I'm going to make 90 chains because this is the exact material that we are going to need for this blanket. After the 90 chains, we are going to crochet two more. This stitch will be of multiple of six. You're going to insert your hook in the fifth chain we are going to make an extended double crochet and in the same stitch we are going to make one extended crochet. This will be a double crochet of two crochet. We will chain one more and in the same stitch we are going to make two extended double crochets like this. And we are going to create a shell. So two extended double crochet one chain and two extended double crochet and here we have one shell. Skip two and in the third chain we are going to insert our hook and we are going to make an extended double crochet. Of two crochets, okay? Then we are going to skip one, two and in the third chain we are going to insert our hook and we are going to make a shell. Remember to extend the double crochets together, one chain, and then in the same stitch, to extend the double crochets. You will see that you will love this blanket. This material is so soft and puffy. But well, we are going to continue like this the whole row, making one shell, one extended double crochet, 
and one share and like this until we finish okay so see you there Turn around, we will finish with one extended double crochet at the end. Chain two, we are going to make them loose, okay? And here is where we are going to start and make crochet in relief. So here we have these two double crochet. The second one is the one that we are going to take it from the back. Take one and take two. Then when we made the division chain, we are going to make one extended double crochet of two crochet, one chain, one extended double crochet of two crochets, and then the one in relief. Between these two, the one that it's in the center. So we are going to repeat the shell, but the one that are in each side is the one that we are going to take in relief. So now we have the single extended so double crochet. We are going to take it in relief too, like this, and then we are going to take this one in relief, and we are going to repeat one inside, one chain, and then the other one inside, and then in relief, and the extended double crochet that it's along. We are going to take it in relief too. Well, we are going to continue like this the whole row. As you can see, it's the same series that we follow in the last row, but the extended double crochet that are in each side, we are going to take them in relief. Well, at the end of the row, we are going to turn around. We are going to crochet two chains loose. And we are going to repeat the same, but instead of insert our hook from the front, we are going to insert our hook from the back like this. Okay, so here goes the series again. We are going to insert our hook from the back, one extended double crochet of two crochets, then here, one extended double crochet. one chain, the other extended double crochet, and from the back, here, one more in relief. And then this one that goes along, we are going to take it from the back too, in relief. Then the second extended double crochet of our shell, we are going to take it from the back, in relief like this, remember of two crochets. So, one chain, one extended double crochet of two crochets, and then the one in relief, and then the single extended double crochet from the back to in relief too. And like this is how we are going to continue the whole row. This is the wrong side and this is the right side. So let's continue and later on you will see that we will form like palm tree. So we are going to go up with, with, with two chains and we will continue with the series that we were making before. In this case, we are going to take the stitch. I mean, we are going to insert our hook from the front like this. So this is how we are going to continue one um, row in the wrong side and one row in the right side in relief, okay? So look here, we are forming the little palm tree. So we are going to continue until we obtain the long of the blanket that we want or until we finish our yarn. I will count the rows to tell you exactly how many rows you are going to make, okay? So let's continue. So we are going to repeat this series and I already count and I have 50 pounds 3 and I measure it and I have 110 centimeters of long and of width 83 centimeters. And we are going to finish like that. If you want you can add 
uh, a final edge with a different stitch but you will need more material and for now I just going to uh, hide all of these loose threads and well that's it look at the color you can start with the light color or with the darker color it's up to you but well at the end it's the same I think that the stitch is so beautiful and I love the effect of this material the, the, the colors how they decorate it and how softy and puffy this material is okay so let's see how it looks I hope that you have enjoyed making this video with me so let's see well so what do you think I think that the secret of this blanket is the material the material is so soft and beautiful that with any stitch it will look good okay if you make this um, blanket please take a picture and tag me I love to see you wearing this blanket and enjoying this blanket with your family Merry Christmas I hope that you have a beautiful day I hope that all your wishes came through and see you the next year okay please continue and keep in me send me your ideas to the email of tejiamigas at gmail.com there i will be receiving all your ideas and i promise that as soon as i can make them i will share them okay so continue enjoying this time with your family and with the ones that you love thank you for watching this video and thank you for subscribing to my channel see you the next wednesday and don't forget to subscribe bye